to this special multiplayer DVD version of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Your chance to try your luck in that famous hot seat and compete against your family or friends to be the first to reach the magical million pound mark. And the chance, of course, to win a family holiday to Universal Mediterranean. Now, all you need is your DVD remote control. You can move around the screen and make your choices by using the up, down, left, right, and enter buttons. It really couldn't be simpler. Right, if you're ready, let's play. Right, here we go. Let's go over the rules, although I'm sure you're familiar with them all by now. You are 15 correct answers away from winning a virtual million pounds. Now, as always, you can walk away at any time. And if you do get stuck, then you have the usual three lifelines. There's 50-50. You can phone a friend, or of course you can ask the audience. OK, if you're ready, all you need to do now is select the number of players, and we can play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Right, you have 15 questions and three lifelines. The very best of luck, let's play. Okay, for 100 quid, here's question number one. No problems there, that's the right answer. Have a look at question number two, it's worth 200 quid. You're absolutely correct. Well played. Here's question number three. It's worth £300. Jolly good. It's the right answer. Remember, a wrong answer here and you will leave with nothing. I'm sure that won't happen. Question number four. That's the right answer. It's going really well so far. Now, get the next question correct and you'll leave with at least a thousand pounds. Good luck. Here comes question number five. OK, you'd like to ask the audience. Audience, have a look at the possible options. Are you ready? OK. All vote now. Very good. No problem at all. Right answer. You've reached the first milestone, that's £1,000. Now, have a look at question six, because it could double your money to 2000 What is the title of Andy Warhol's series of screen prints featuring a famous actress? Marilyn, Bridget, Raquel, Sophia.
Now, are you happy for it to go orange? It's worth £2,000. Well played, that's correct. Here comes question number seven out of a possible 15. It's worth £4,000. Good luck. In which country is the Gibson Desert? USA, Australia, South Africa, or New Zealand? Final answer. You lose a grand if it's wrong. Congratulations, that's the right answer. Okay, if you choose the right answer to the next question, you can double your money to £8,000. Let's have a look at question 8 of 15. From which pulses is the Middle Eastern dish falafel usually made? Lentils, red beans, chickpeas, black eye beans. Okay, you've decided to use your phone a friend lifeline. Choose the friend you'd like to call, but remember, you do not have to go along with their answer. Ah, uh, well, I'd be tempted to go for C, but then again, well, it's not my money. Ah, uh, I'm not sure, so it would be a risk. Congratulations, that's the right answer. Right, the jumps are starting to get a lot bigger now. Here is question nine for a possible £16,000. In which city might you cross the Lendl or Skeldergate bridges? Chester, York, Nottingham, Derby. You're absolutely correct. Well played. OK, this is where the drops start to get steeper. Get the next question wrong and you lose £15,000. But get it right and you win £32,000 guaranteed. Which of these names means universal ruler? Julius Caesar, Mahatma Gandhi, Genghis Khan or Dalai Lama? Right, computer, we need a bit of help here. Take two of the answers away and hopefully make things a bit easier. Jolly good, it's the right answer. Right, question number 11 is worth £64,000. You would still walk away with 32000 even if you got it wrong. But let's hope you don't. What does the W in George W. Bush stand for? William, Wickham, Walker, Wakefield. Congratulations, that's the right answer. Right, the next question is worth a whopping £125,000. It's number 12 of a possible 15. Take your time, it's a lot of money. Which of the following is not an alien in the teen drama Roswell? Max, Isabel. Liz or Michael? Yes, that's the right answer. Right, now just take your time and relax. The next question is number 13 of a possible 15. If you answer and you're wrong, you drop back to £32,000. Here's the question for a quarter of a million. Which of these is not a fielding position in cricket? Leg glance, leg slip, long leg, 
fine leg. Absolutely spot on. Well done. This is now getting very, very serious. You are just two correct answers away from winning one million pounds. But if you give me a wrong answer here, you will lose 218,000 pounds. Not good. Have a look at question number 14. But think very carefully about what you want to do. The Swede Major Ernst Killander is credited with inventing which sport? Triathlon, orienteering, korfball, or ice speedway? That's absolutely correct. Well played. Fantastic, you have played a brilliant game so far and now you have 500,000 pounds. But we would really like to give you one million. Take as long as you need. Here comes the million pound question. What typically British item was given to Brad Pitt in June 2003? Bowler hat, blue Peter badge, cricket ball, or Rolls-Royce car? Well, you could have walked away with half a million pounds. But instead, you'll be walking away with one million pounds. That's the right answer. Fantastic. What a tremendous game. All 15 questions answered correctly. Well done. You are a virtual millionaire. Congratulations. Now, for a chance of jetting off for a fabulous holiday to Universal Mediterranean, all you have to do is write this special win code on the postcard provided and send it to us in the post. It couldn't be easier. Good. Well done and thank you for playing. Who wants to be a millionaire?